Hello everyone and welcome to PlayStation Access. My name is Ash and today we're checking out all the games joining the Game Catalogue and Classics Catalogue for PlayStation Plus Extra and Premium members this August. Before we dive into the lineup though, do remember that PlayStation 5 owners can access any PS4 titles via backwards compatibility. And of course, do make sure you've subscribed and clicked the notification bell so you get these PlayStation Plus updates as soon as they arrive. First up, we're off to Savathun's throne world in Destiny 2 The Witch Queen. Savathun, of course, being the Witch Queen of the title. She also goes by Sister of Shapes and Swordbreaker. Stealing my names much? Whatever you want to call her though, she's bad news. And now you're turning up in her home, with its opulent palaces and corrupted swamps, looking for a fight. It's a killer addition to Destiny 2, held up by the community as one of the best expansions yet. Much of the appeal lies in the light-wielding Lucent Hype, who mimic Guardians right down to the space magic and their own ghosts who revive them on death. They're an enemy as capable as you, and form the backbone of a story that revives years-old plot threads and starts building the Light and Darkness saga to a resolution. Remember that the core game is already free to play, so grab The Witch Queen on PS4 or PS5 when it comes to Game Catalogue on the 15th of August. Now, this next one looks really special. Sea of Stars for PS4 and PS5 comes from the team behind The Messenger. Where that game harked back to 8- and 16-bit era action platformers, this one's an ode to 16-bit RPGs. Think Chrono Trigger or Secret of Mana. We're talking chunky sprites, punchy turn-based combat, and naturally, a banging soundtrack. In fact, this even shares a composer with those earlier games. JRPG royalty Yasunori Mitsuda contributes some tunes. That sound you hear right now is Rob rubbing his hands with excitement, don't worry. It looks gorgeous and plays just as well, jazzing up a tactical battle system with real-time button presses that add extra juice to attacks and the ability to combo party members for devastating moves. Best of all, it launches straight into the PlayStation Plus game catalogue, but a little later than the other August editions. It's out on PS4 and PS5 on the 29th of August. Another game releasing brand new onto PlayStation Plus is Moving Out 2, the sequel to 2020's hectic moving simulator. Think of it like Overcooked meets Furniture Removal, as a gang of up to four workers cooperate to strip properties of their furniture and heave it into a moving lorry. But it also has a hefty dose of cartoony physics, meaning chaos inevitably ensues and all those precious possessions end up in a teetering pile. This time, mysterious portals whisk us to even more outlandish lands, so you're navigating sweetie kingdoms and giant rotating castles. Exactly the kind of thing to push fragile friendships to breaking point. Luckily, you can keep your distance though this time, as it has online play, should you so wish. And of course, it'll be very easy to find friends to play with, since Moving Out 2 releases on PS4 and PS5 on the 15th of August, straight into the PlayStation Plus game catalogue. Next, if you prefer to knuckle down with an epic single-player story, then Lost Judgment is an amazing addition to PlayStation Plus this month. This Yakuza spin-off swaps gangsters for gumshoes. You play as detective Takeyuri Yagami as he investigates the murder of a teacher in Yokohama. If you played the original Judgment, you'll know this is a cool twist on the Yakuza formula. Tak can hold his own in a fight, but also investigates crime scenes, sneaks into enemy territory, and stalks suspects through the streets. But as this sequel takes us into the education system, it also includes an undercover mission in a local school. You have to infiltrate clubs by mastering everything from amateur robotics to boxing to dancing to skateboarding. It's basically a whole other campaign hidden alongside the main case. It is a fantastic adventure that'll eat up weeks of your time, so prepare to enroll in Lost Judgment on PS4 and PS5 when it comes to the game catalogue on the 15th of August. Finally, our next game is a genre mashup you didn't know you wanted. A golf roguelike. In Curse to Golf, you play as a golfer struck by lightning and sent to hell, where he's given a chance to play his way out of the underworld by defeating an 18-hole course. These are not your PGA regulation holes, of course, but fiendish mazes tackled from a 2D perspective. It's up to you to pick between your driver, iron and wedge to find the best tool for each obstacle, whilst also spending gold on ace cards that grant temporary power-ups. That's where the real roguelike magic kicks in, as cards and money are lost if you fail to finish a hole, forcing you to start another run with a completely different set of trick shots. Will you ever nail the perfect run of holes and escape the inferno? When you're having this much fun, I'm not sure you need to. Attempt your own resurrection when Curse to Golf comes to game catalogue for PS4 and PS5 on the 15th of August. 
But that's not all. Also joining the game catalogue for PlayStation Plus Extra and Premium members from the 15th of August are the following games. Destroy All Humans 2, Reprobed, Source of Madness, PJ Masks, Heroes of the Night, Hotel Transylvania, Scary Tale Adventures, and Spellforce 3 Reforced are all coming to PS4 and PS5. While Two Point Hospital Jumbo Edition, Dreams, and Midnight Fight Express are coming to PS4. And on the 28th of August, Lawn Mowing Simulator Landmark Edition joins PS Plus as a day one release on PS4 and PS5. Then, joining the Classics catalogue for PlayStation Plus Premium members, Medieval Resurrection, Ape Escape P, and Pursuit Force Extreme Justice. All originally for the PSP and now playable on PS4 and PS5. Don't forget there are already tons of fantastic games available on PlayStation Plus to check out, and that PlayStation Plus Essential, which is included within the extra and premium tiers, offers monthly downloadable games at no extra cost. Essential games are yours to keep for as long as you remain a Plus member, so check out our video on August PlayStation Plus Essential lineup if you haven't yet claimed your games. Let us know in the comments what you're most excited for this month, and don't forget to give us a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon. Extension.